Welcome to the Islamic Forment. I greet you all with the same greetings of peace that have been used from all the Prophets from Adam to Muhammad. The greeting of Assalamu Alaikum. For those of you that don't understand what this means, it's simply Arabic for peace be upon you. I bear witness that there's only one God and Muhammad is the messenger of God. My brothers and sisters, I invite you all to embrace Islam. I invite you all to come to truth. There is only one God. He begets not, nor is he begotten. It says in the Quran, in Surah 112, chapter 112, it says, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Kulhu Allahu ahad, Allahu samad, Lam yalad wa lam yulad, wa lam yakun lahu kufan ahad. Say, He is God, the One, the Only, the Eternal, the Absolute. He begets not, nor is He begotten, and there is none comparable unto Him. My brothers and sisters, don't be misled by people that want to misdirect you and guide you away from Islam by saying that Islam is a terrorist religion. It is not. Don't let people guide you away from Islam saying that the Muslims worship the devil because we don't. We worship the same God that the Christians worship. The same God that the Jews worship. My brothers and sisters, don't let people lie to you and mislead you and pull you away from Islam trying to fool you with trickery saying that Muslims don't believe that the same way the Christians believe that we don't believe the same way the Jews believe. In actuality, we believe more like the Jews believe than you do. Muslims, they get circumcised, whereas the Christians don't. Why? Why is this? Have you asked, why could that be? Circumcision was only meant for boys, but yet somebody made it to seem like it was only circumcision of the heart. Why is that? Muslims believe that there's only one God. He has no partners to Him. He is the Creator. He is not comparable to creation. Muslims believe that God is our Creator. Muslims believe that we will return to Him. We believe in heaven and hell. We believe in the day of judgment, the day of resurrection. We believe in all the prophets from God all the books from God and believe me heaven and hell are real do you want to go to heaven or do you want to go to hell this is the question that you have to ask don't think that you have a free ticket to get into heaven it's not that way God created a heaven and hell for a purpose he didn't just create hell to sit there and just say oh if you accept Jesus as your Savior go to heaven no, you have to work to get there. You have to worship your God. The only purpose in this life is to worship God. To enjoin what is good and to forbid what is evil. This is the only way that you're going to get to heaven. That you're going to stay away from hell. So I beg of you, for your safety, for your salvation, accept Islam. Say yourself, I bear witness that there's only one God and Muhammad is the final messenger from God. Say it yourself. Pick up a Quran and actually read. Don't just read lines that people are putting down. Don't go to these anti-Islamic sites. Some good sites that I recommend you go to? TheIslamicInformant.com IslamWay.com IslamOnline Islam101.com Go to these sites. Don't go to these anti-Islamic sites. These people that preach hate. They're the ones who are lying to you. And they will be judged accordingly. I cannot say what God, how God will judge them. But they will be judged accordingly. Pray to Allah. Pray to God. And, and I'm sorry if I use the word Allah for those of you that don't understand. It is just the Arabic word for God. It was used pre-Islamically, before Islam, by Christians and Jews. It was used hundreds of years before Islam by Christians and Jews. 
It's just an Arabic word. Don't let people try to mislead you saying, oh, it's the rock god or it was the high god. No, 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 no. It's not. Don't let them lie to you and deceive you. They're just trying to keep you away from Islam because they know that Islam is the fastest growing religion. And why do you think that is? Why do you think that Islam is the fastest growing religion? Because more and more people are reading for themselves. And more and more people are reading the Quran and find, finding out that all these lies that have been told to them are false. So again, I beg of you, accept Islam for your salvation. Worship your God, one God, the Creator. The Creator of the heavens and earth, the Creator of you, the Creator of me. Worship Him. He has no partners. I leave you the way I came. I leave you in peace. Assalamu alaikum.